at the Taste of Greektown, you can experience food, spirits, live music, and entertainment, even games for the kids. Fun, fun. Here in our Studio 41 kitchen with a preview is Irene Kumi and owner of Spectrum, Spectrum Bar and Grill, Andreas Kumi. Good morning. Good Hi morning. there. Any relation there going no, on? No, this is not at all. Yeah, I know. We're just kidding. Uh, Thank you guys for coming in. This is so fun. Taste yes. of Greek Town. Good time. Opa. You know, Yay. we hear that a lot, right? Yes. From what I looked it up, it's his father or grandfather. So it does it have multiple meanings? The meaning I know is just to celebrate a good time. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Opa. Sometimes I say it when I drop something, <laughs> of course. Oh, um, it's a, like a universal kind of a catch-all word, yeah, huh? Yeah, exactly. Okay. And when you're cheersing, or that's always a good time. Toast. Yeah, okay. yeah. Okay, so the Taste of Greek Town's coming up in a couple weeks. Yes. And yes. what's what's different about this year? Well, this is our 32nd year, and uh, Spectrum's been participating since the beginning. Um, people can expect to get a really good taste of the neighborhood, as always. But we have so many activities for the family and for you know going out and having fun. We have the Yido seating contest. Mm -hmm. uh, we have live Greek dancing. You can learn how to Greek dance as well. We have tons of food from the Greek restaurants in the neighborhood. Beautiful shops, um, oh, artisanal yeah, jewelry. Absolutely. So really just kind of the whole gambit. Yeah. Alright, so we're shitting down uh, Halstead, right? Yes. Halstead between... Uh, between... Van Buren Van Buren. and... And, uh, Jackson. Jackson? No, Jackson. no, no, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. No, Van Buren and Adams. Adams. Adam. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Yep, yep, so yep. we got a nice little stretch there. All right, so you brought in some food for us to try today, yes, right? But absolutely. we also have to point out, this is not the grill that it normally comes in on. We couldn't let ha have you bring in the charcoal grill, so you made an exception for us, so we yes. thank you for that. Yeah. But the food is going to be yummy nonetheless. Tell us what you have for us. So we got, we got the sticks, the pork kebabs, which... Oh. It's sort of almost done here, but I, yeah, I'll show you, you how show? to prepare it. Sure. Uh, to, to, Let's so get, um, for it. I put the meat already cut, and I put some olive oil, Greek olive oil from Kalamata. Oh, it's okay. all organic. It matter, so it we matters. Fly it in. Which, it's okay. match. It, that's it's simple cuisine, so you really have to have. And then I put my ingredients. Greek spi spices. Yep. Mm -hmm. Wild wow. mountain oregano from Greece, also. Oh, I mix it up. Yeah. Such a good flavor. Of course. And where do you get all those ingredients around well, here? Well, uh, you can, you know, we live in a globalized world. So actually for, you know, you can get these in the grocery store or restaurant suppliers, but for the olive oil, we actually go through a friend who does small batch olive oil. We use it in our homes and at the bar okay. uh, for our food. So it's really special that we're able to do that. I love that technique. You stuck the skewer through the lemon to put some lemon on the skewer. Mm, wow. Yeah, the, the lemon kills all the extra bacteria on the <laughs> uh, Oh, that's Oh, okay. <laughs> and it gives some good flavor yeah, too. So. All right. <laughs> so yeah, um, we're talking about the grills. Those are custom ordered from Cyprus, where my dad is from. Uh -huh. And so you'll see those rotating all weekend long. Oh we do yeah. The lamb chops on there, the pork shish kebab, the chicken, and it gives it a, a great flavor and keeps sure. the the meat very tender too. Okay, uh, that's yeah. what we care about: exactly. tender and then also juicy at the same time. Yeah, exactly. So what kind of specials are you having? during uh, the festival? Mm -hmm. um, so we have a myriad of options on the whole street. So you can get everything from, you know, these famous grilled meats that we have to um, lovely baked goods like cheese pies and spinach pies from Adropolis Bakery and Cafe um, to beautiful desserts. I don't know if you've ever had those lucumades. They're the fried uh, donuts soaked in honey sauce. Oh, yeah. Those are, mm -hmm. You can get those year-round in Greek town. However, it's a specialty when you can get them on the street, yeah. you know. Yeah. And, um, you know, the participating restaurants this year are going to be at Topolis Bakery Cafe in Agora, Athena Greek Restaurant, mm -hmm. um, Nine Uses Bar and Grill has also great grilled meats. And uh, Mr. Greek Yidos, which always provides a standard great uh, Yido sandwich. This is truly a family, a yeah. family occasion that everyone should definitely come out and take advantage of. Yeah, absolutely. And that family is like a very important um, value in Greek town in general. And that's what makes the neighborhood unique. You have generations of families that have these businesses and we do have a lot of change in the neighborhood but it is also still a slice of history you can walk into a restaurant and see the owner there and he's gonna he or she will greet you mm -hmm. um, you can go to the Athenian candle shop which has been 
you know, open for 100 years and it's the same family running it. Mm -hmm. So that's what really makes it special. We have that famous Greek hospitality called Philoxenia that we always oh, welcome our yeah. guests with. Yeah. So, All right. Wow. It, are we able to taste this a little bit? Because we got yes. a wrap here. Yes. For just um, so actually, what we can do is uh, put a little pita bread on your plate. Um, Dad, if you want to just. I said, while you're yeah, doing that, we're just going to yeah. point out that the Taste of Greek Town is August 26th through the 28th. It's on Hossa between Adams and Van Buren. There's the social media handles as well as the website there for you to check it out. Is it free? Um, it's a seven dollar suggested donation, but okay. like any street festival, it is free. So we're oh, we welcome everyone to come through. All, All right. right, Irene and Andreas, thank you so yeah. much. Thank you.